buddy. <laughs> See what's happening in sublimation world. Maybe we should play with the thing while we're waiting to put some crazy hats on. Or... Wait, really? Yeah, you know, that thing you like. Um, okay. What does this do? That's pretty cool. Okay. You try one. Oh, no. Um, this does nothing. Nothing. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Spinning wheel is doing something. Oh. All right, let's <laughs> We're turning it back. We're turning it back right now. Hi, Mara. Hope you're feeling good. How are you? That's what he does to the competition. Hey, what's happening? We, hey, Prince of uh, <clears throat> Prince of Passaic. All right. Hey, Dawn. What's happening? All right, guys. Good evening. Good evening. There we go. Okay, good. Thank you, Scotty. That was funny. You slide in more. Let me get over here for a minute. Is anybody coming out? Speaking of, uh, oh, thank you for joining us, first of all. Um, uh, who's coming out to the MBM show, Meadowlands? And then who's going to join us uh, for our open house the day after? I'm sorry, the show's not on a Saturday. That's why we opened up for everybody, pretty much. Mm -hmm. So we'll make life easy. All right. Uh, again, thank you guys for joining us. Hold on. What do we got there? I should, but won't comment. On that one, Scotty. LOL. Wait, wait, wait. We're backwards now? I thought I put that. Oh, the picture of you with the kitty cat. The kitty cat. They like that one. Jason, all good. Lana, what's happening, lovey? Lovey. Mr. Yang, how are you, sir? So, everybody, aloha out in Hawaii. We got China, we got Hawaii. Where else are we from tonight, everybody? Why don't you put down what country or what state you're from while we're getting ready to go? Please, let's see where everybody's from tonight. We got 32 of you. We like participation, so put in what state you're from or what country you're from. Hey, Anka, we got our shirts of the night. Scotty decided to do a cool one for himself. Scotty, step back, show that red. That red on our shirt came out phenomenal. Scotty, oh, ooh, ooh. There it is. He says it all. Now, I got a trivia quiz for my shirt. While everybody's typing and putting in their states, next, tell me what movie this is from. Tell me what movie my shirt is from. Little quiz tonight. You saw that shirt. We got Texas, Massachusetts, New York, Louisiana. There we go. I like participation. It's all about you guys, the end finishers. You know that. So while we're going, uh, we're going to keep going on, everybody. They're still typing away. Canada. There we go. Colorado. Texas. Very nice. Very nice. Thank you guys for participating. I appreciate that a lot. Well, we got our new Sublimation 101 product we launched, and we're going to give you a full view tonight. We're going to have some fun doing it. Shirt of the night. Ah, 
we got from all over the United States, everywhere. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Well, again, on behalf of myself, Scotty, Martha Ray, the staff at Sublimation 101, we always thank you guys for joining us. Tonight, we got a nice treat for you. Mm -hmm. Let me know when you're ready to grab the camera. Right now. Let's do it. So easy to make. We got our cool new product. Come on over, Scotty. They've seen them, but now I want to show everybody the colors and the styles. We got our new Sublimation 101. We got our PU leather eel skin bags in. This is the larger purse. Let me get out the phone. For the license, it's got a carrier, zipper pocket. It's got a nice wide gusset. You're gonna see the difference in a minute, guys. And when you flip it around over to the other side, credit card holder, another pocket. What makes it different, this is not fabric on the front, guys. This is a smooth, you can hear it, pristine, sleen, sheen surface. It's not gonna fade on you, it's not gonna, get fuzzy or turn color on it. We've got a good variety of colors. Scotty's gonna pan on over here to show mm -hmm. them our new line of colors of our purses. And then I'll show them the fronts as we go along with the designs we did. So we'll start with our pinkish color. We did the MRC on the front. We added a lot of color and vibrancy to it. To our silver gray. We did an Angel Baby logo. And just remember, the, the matching strap is removable. You open the bag, mm -hmm. it can be a larger clutch purse. It does clip right on and right off. Mm -hmm. Okay. And as we move along over here, we have our soft beige, where we did our leopard print on. We did our black. We added some color vibrancy to it. We did our turquoise with the C. All the insides are black, so everybody can see. And we did a cork for the wine color. Again, so fast and fun and easy to make. <clears throat> we'll start with the large purse bag, which the product link will be up on the end of the video. It comes with the pouch protective for you the end finisher no dirt no debris going on to the white okay so we're gonna come over we're gonna remove it from its packaging and we'll come over to creative studio any questions while we're going along Scotty um, anchor got it mm -hmm. got it okay so Scotty I'm gonna go into creative studio and I'm gonna simply measure the bag I have about 8.25 going wide. Yep. And in my height, I've got about 4.75. What is your suggested retail price? Honestly, mm -hmm. $34.99 to $45.99. It's a one of a kind. This is, <clears throat> I want everybody to understand what this material is. I work with the factory in China, who the gentleman who does produce this for me is watching us right now, live. Okay, this is a PU synthetic leather. If you ever go into a furniture store and they tell you it's a PU leather, they're not gonna say PU, they're gonna tell you it's a polyester leather. It's the same thing as what furniture stores use. It's a very durable product. You see me digging into it with my nails. It's not gonna fall apart on you. It is a very quality product. As a matter of fact, guys, they're selling really great and I'm glad everybody that's using them is working with them. I have the next line of the PU leather is women's wallets to go along with it. We'll show you a sneak peek later. Let's go over here and get our product going. We have an 8.25 by a 4.75. Okay, we can go to image and I can see what I have in love. I think I do have something in love. Whoops, I jumped the gun there. Sorry about that. 
did have something very pretty that looks good on the beige bag in the large size, I believe. There it is right there, the love pattern. I'm gonna bring it into Creative Studio simply and I'm gonna rotate it 90 degrees and I am gonna shrink it down. I wanna keep proportion with my size, so I'm gonna double check my purse and I have an 8.25 width, so I'm at eight inches now. So at eight inches, I'm gonna go 8.25, which is pretty much where I need to be. My height is calling for a 4.75, where I'm at a 5.50. So I could shrink it down a little, but I don't want to distort the lettering. So I'm going to print it at the actual size that I have it. Align horizontally and align vertically. You're going to hit print. Right here, you're going to hit OK. And you're simply going to follow your Virtuoso Print Manager procedure. We're going to print this at a high speed, guys. We're going to use our press time tonight at 400 degrees for 45 seconds. So we're gonna get a view of our image on our paper. There we go. Polyester fabric, text print R, tray select, high speed mirror image. Our color is a graphic. I'm not touching anything else and I'm simply gonna hit print. That is done, ready to go. Wanna be unique this holiday season, we're gonna be bringing in a lot more different items at Sublimation 101, guys. And some of them are gonna be a higher, higher range, price range of item, but it's gonna be, what we're looking at is we're bringing more unique items to the sublimation market and to the United mm -hmm. States for other vendors as well. So there's gonna be a lot happening with this particular product you see me working with between phone cases and more. So I'm simply gonna take my bag and get nice and comfortable. I'm just gonna put it right onto my heat press like so. I'm gonna put it <clears throat> right down in the front and I'm gonna line up a piece of heat tape right at the bottom of the bag where it's gonna go right to my top seam, like so, guys. Just press it down, double check your work, make sure you're right on that seam. Go into the light, you'll catch a better view, just to protect your, your product. I like to use two pieces of tape, and what I do here, guys, is I'll fold this one right over like so for an easy peel, and also, whoops, also, besides an easy peel, guys, it also, reusable for my next product, which is gonna be the clutch bag. When are we getting uh, new holiday items in? New holiday items will be coming in in September. Late September, early October. We have a wide variety of stuff coming in. Thank you whoever asked, that was a great question. Catherine Golden. See you in September, I hope. Mm-hmm. Now, in positioning of my purse, my purse is gonna go face up. I'm gonna hold my transfer up to the light to make sure I have it going the right way with the right positioning, which will be perfect like that. I'm simply gonna take my purse and I'm gonna line up everything I want inside that designated area like so. And I'm gonna use two pieces of heat tape on the side and hold it right in place. Heat tape is your best friend, it's reusable, it doesn't leave marks, imperfections, take color away, anything. I'm gonna simply put it right under like so. I'm gonna pick it up. I'm just gonna give a peek at the top, make sure I got everything in, which is perfect. I'm gonna put it right under my heat press for 400 degrees for one minute. Give a peek under to make sure everything is fully right under the heat press. So that's gonna go under while that one's going. I'm gonna grab the strap to put on, because don't forget. There's a removable strap that goes on, and here's the strap to put on. Any questions, Scotty, while we're going along? Hmm, that strap, where do you put the strap on? There's two little holes right inside. Okay. And then go right in, I'll show you as soon as I open this up for you. Did somebody, who asked that? Good question. I'm gonna open it right up like so, guys. I'm simply going to remove my transfer, like so. This is why I have the heat tape. Let it cool down for a second, right onto your product. 
This is why I have the heat tape on here to protect it from any residue or anything that will go onto my bag. In result, giving me a not clean product. This is what the heat tape protected from going on the PU leather. Mm -hmm. And that is our finished bag. Very simple, very easy. Our bags are snaps, they're not magnets. So you don't have to worry about it damaging, doing any damage under the heat press. Mm -hmm. it stays nice and shut. And you were asking about the strap on, I'll show you that right now. You're simply gonna open up your bag and put the strap right on. It has two little loops right on either side. You put it in, insert it, bring it back over. See it closer. Just snap right here. Click, and you're mm -hmm. strapped on. Done. Ready to go to your customer. Right to the end finisher. I'll show you a finished look at the front a little closer. Mhm. Mm awesome. Getting a lot of love. A lot of love for the <clears> book <throat> bag. <clears throat> That's what we like. Scotty, our next bag I'd like to show everybody is the clutch. Come on over. Okay. This was the ones you designed actually, Scott. Oh. Scott did the design of the clutch purse, which the clutch purse again has a strap that comes off. It's a full chain strap, unlike the larger purse that has a matching PU leather. The clutch bag has a removable chain strap to go on. And this would be the clutch purse with the same snap and design and inside, as the purse, just a smaller clutch version. Nothing different in our design. You have a front pocket right here. You have a zipper pocket right here for protection. There's different wallet cases in there. You have a front opening ID spot. And again, so if anybody asks, I'll show you again. We're simply going to click the strap on and put it right on. These are the ones that Scotty designed when we were doing our open house, if I remember correctly. Well, actually, the image came from a Disney cruise ship, but it's a fantastic one. Scotty did a wine. This is the wine color clutch. We have it in the one that you guys love so much that I took one of Scotty's images. <laughs> yep. Scotty designed that, and I loved it so much I wanted to use his image tonight. Scotty got a little creative here. Threw a little color into the black. Mm -hmm. It's the black PU, eel skin leather. You saw the beige, you saw the red. We got the, the cool pink. Scotty did a little makeup design on it. I'll show him again. This one goes out to a friend of mine who's watching tonight. Dawn Davis, this one's all for you, babe. This one's all you. We use the gray PU eel skin. Again, guys, if you're asking me about Christmas, here's stuff right now. You're asking me what's new for Christmas? This is what's new for Christmas for you. You should be marketing this right now. This is the time, this is the time of year. And this is how you're gonna do it. Again, they come packaged, nice and simple right here. Like Does I it come you. in red? I showed, this is the closest to the red we're getting. Mm -hmm. Which is right here. Would you call it red? Depends uh, how you look at yep. it. Yep, they can see it. Good. Would they like to see the colors again, Scotty? Here you go. Here you go, I can line up all the colors for everybody. These are our all our beautiful colors. They come, all colors are available in the clutch and the purse. Okay. Got our chain for the one we're about to make. Let's get something pretty cool to put on this one. Let's go with some sugar skulls. I'm gonna prep my item like so. right on 
down to the edges. Again, I like to use two pieces of tape. You can use a piece of paper in between, whatever you feel comfortable. I'm just accustomed to the way I'm doing it and I know it worked without an issue. So I have two pieces of tape. Mm -hmm. Let me look it up into the light. Everything is covered. I put my finger right along the seam there. Get everything filled in. Perfect. Okay, come on over. Let's go pick something out. <clears throat> Let's take the measurement, Scotty. Ah, she is looking at about almost eight inches long and three and a half inches. Let's go 3.75. So let's go 8.25 by 3.75 for our image okay. size, okay? So Michael, do you yes. have a blank ad on Facebook for these? A blank flyer? Yep. Not yet, we are making one. Good evening, Rose. Rose, Rose? Yeah, Fleming. Hi, Rose. Hope all is well. Baby is gorgeous. You know that already. You don't need me to tell you. I've been watching. Hope to see you up here soon. Uh, Polly S. 